All right, uh, it's been a real minute since I uploaded anything uh, in the past like month or so. Um, yeah, I've kind of tapered off with the whole hobby itself, but uh, I still have some stuff that was that came in the mail pretty uh, recently. So my plans are for the rest of like this channels or my interest in the hobby itself. I think I'm just gonna buy stuff off eBay, like cheap stuff, maybe around ten, fifteen dollars, stuff like that. Um, you know, keep things fresh, cards that I like, things like that. But I just wanted to show the collection in this video as well as this quick mail day. And I was actually going to go through a bunch of Leaf. You know, I don't open Leaf, but maybe open it for Kyler Murray. Uh, you know, he still has some value, so might as well crack those packs open. And this is a trade I made off Reddit. Let's see what. It's been almost a month since I got it. I don't remember the package that was in there, but let's see. stuff like this man hey Santosh thanks for working out this trade with me I just got back into collecting last year I'm trying to film my pictures <laughs> so I sent him um some rated rookies of Sonny Michel Sonny Sony Michelle geez it's been so long without sports I'm mispronouncing people's names um, let's see, yeah, Patriots PC from the last 20 years I hope these 29 oh man this is awesome I think I sent him um hold up the guy on the Patriots that dropped so many, Malcolm Mitchell, yeah, Malcolm Mitchell, uh, mini uh, tops rookie card, that was really sick, this week uh, is pretty sweet, I look forward to seeing what mystery card he throw into a package, yeah, I threw him a bunch of um, random Patriots that I found, um, oh, thanks Dan, that was awesome, alright, let's pop into this, I know he threw in some Daniel Jones stuff, because, you know, I love me some Danny Dimes, I'm probably the only Eagles fan in history that says shit like this i mean come on how can you be an eagles fan and still like the opposing team like it's, it's, it's truly something special but man i love watching this kid play oh shit uh, he packaged it nice don't mind that at all protected all right i don't remember what i got other than this dk patch Woo! sweet sweet looking dk metcalf rookie patch rookie gears uh, this is from retail, but I don't mind. DK is an awesome dude. Uh, I fucking hate that JJ Arcega Whiteside was taken right before him. Like, come on, man. Our Eagles staff just suck at scouting wide receivers, which is why I'm scared about Jalen Rager. Easton Stick, cool, rated rookie, nice. Awesome. Let's see. Ooh, okay, Terry, Scary Terry, the rookies. That is a sweet-looking card. Terry McLaurin out of Donner's 2019. Man, I'm praying for Dwayne Haskins to get his shit together. Make the right read. Stay poised. Just just be confident with, with the ball. And look at this bad boy. Daniel Jones. Danny Dimes, baby. Rookie card out of Absolute. Love it. Thanks, Dan. Uh, probably not watching this, but thank you. Um, maybe, I don't know what to do with these, actually, I don't know if I want to open them up, I don't even like opening up Leaf, because it's like so, so underwhelming. You know what, maybe just the 2018 pack, see what we get. Still possibly get like Baker, uh, or Lamar, maybe. Callaway, he's done. Luke Falk, oh my god, he's terrible. Maurice Hurst, Nick Chubb, that's cool. And Josh Rosen, who's probably going to be out of the league in about a year or two. I don't know if there's a place for him. Uh, I don't know. All right, uh, let's see what else is left. Actually, one more. One more pack of Leaf Draft. All right. Let's see, Earl Campbell, Beast. Okay. Kyle Klempt, okay. Drew Locke, that's nice. Drew Locke is, I love my Drew Locke. Benny Snell, okay. And Cleland Farrell. No, what, number th third round, third pick in that draft last year? That's insane. But, alright, the collection itself, I'm going to start right here. Got this from a hot pack. Uh, Bernard Berrien, um, patch. Yeah, event used football, event worn jersey, sick, sick patch, sick card itself. I mean, absolute mem from 2004. Love it. And if you don't know, uh, numbered out of 750, Bernard Berrien has the 
Chicago Bears' uh, longest receiving touchdown, which is pretty sick. I think it's 99 yards or something like that, or the longest on-field touchdown. Sidney Jones, uh, I got this out of a hot pack as well, 45, 49, 45 out of 49. Clean-looking card, clean-looking auto. I just don't think he's going to be uh, anything. He's done. He's most likely done with football in general. Um, Premier jerseys, Rashad Penny. Man, this guy's he, he started blowing up in the last few games of this season before he tore his ACL in 2019. Uh, he's, I think he's going to have a great career. Uh, let's see, Derek Rogers. Um, I want to say he's a corner, right? Even though he's in the Bull, uh, Bills jersey in this, uh, uh, in this card. Yeah, 92 out of 99. Let me see. Uh, yeah, defensive back. Wait, is that what it says? No, he's a wide receiver. I'm an idiot. Yeah. Sometimes you just can't tell. Jalen Strong. I don't even know what the hell he's up to anymore. Um, is he even on the uh, Texans, um, what do you call it, roster? Listed as a wide receiver? I don't know. 54 out of 99. Clean looking playbook. Jalen Strong. Mm, nice looking card. Yeah, playbook. That, that auto looks really nice. Uh, an empty card. I don't know what the hell that is. Brandon Coleman. It's been a while since I've heard that name. Rookie auto uh, out of Tops Platinum, right? Yeah, clean looking card. He's a big dude too. Let me see stats on here. Six six two twenty. A damn six. And he went to Rutgers. Look at that, repping that Rutgers. Are you rah rah? That's dope. Tommy Tommy Harris, uh, rookie card. I want to say yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah, those those uh, dollar signs or dollar um, estimates are not mine. Pretty sure I got them out of. Uh, the people who sold it to me. Let's see what's next. Devaris Daniels. Okay, not 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 great, but it's something. It's something. Ooh, I love this one. A dress code Brandon Jacobs. Oh man, this guy was a goddamn machine. Two sixty out of two ninety nine. Clean looking card. NFL game used. I love that. Thank God I didn't even realize that. I got this from a. A um, lot of 50 cards or so, something like that, for like 40 bucks. There's a bunch of awesome stuff in there. Game worn jersey, awesome. Martian, Marshawn Coprich, uh, Coprick, Coprich. Let's see what school he went to. I can't tell because it's Sage, and Sage in, is useless. I mean, hit, yeah, Sage hit. I'm like, what the fuck? All right, Knights of the Round Table, Jaleel Scott. Oh, I remember pulling this card from a retail, like, a uh, big opening. And look at that. Uh, I ran out of sleeves, so I started using Magic the Gathering sleeves on that. Phil Sims rookie card. Isn't that sweet? Oh, man. Once again, I always found... No, not a rookie card. Sophomore year. Yeah. I always have more... I have more uh, Giants cards than Eagles cards, which is pretty funny, in my opinion. But I love that one. Uh, Harry Carson, a beast. Another beast. Classic card. This is a really good set that it came out of. I don't remember what it is, but I know it's a good one. Oh, Trey Marshall. Good uh, linebacker, yeah. Middle linebacker, I'm pretty sure, is what he played. Um, I remember watching a few games. Him and the other guy. There's a new guy that came up this past year for the uh, Broncos defense. Who killed it. He absolutely killed it. It might have been the... Might have been a safety who played out all over the field. Don't remember, but man, he was good. Strahan Pro Bowl jersey. Woo. Once again, more Giants cards than an Eagles cards. Like, what the fuck is happening? Damn. All right, Pro Bowl jersey score. Oh, yes, yeah, so was out of a score pack. I think a fat pack. Yeah, clean looking. See, how is this not game worn, though? If it's a play, uh, Pro Bowl jersey, it's player worn. It makes no fucking sense. Like, I would have loved for that to be game worn. How sick would that be? Oh, I got this out of uh, um, Brian Planty's Hot Packs. Kind of expensive for, it was like 33 bucks. I got a Jim, Jim Brown, but at an out of 10. But this one, I, I think this one's better in terms of value. Alexander Madison really has potential to become a star. Um, if they don't pay Dalvin Cook, whew. This man is going to rise in stock. 
And what's interesting is all the a lot of the cards are getting pretty expensive right now. I don't know what it is, but if you check on eBay, whew, shit is expensive. Rojo the second, uh, man, he's underwhelming every single year. I feel like oh, it's kind of dented over there. No worries. Yeah, it's a bit underwhelming, but you get what you. you You've seen what he can do. He's he's good. He's good enough, but nothing special. Um, Josh Jacobs, rookie. Love that card. Look at him. He's looking all scared and shit. Look at those teeth. Looking like a beaver. All right, Josh Jacobs. He had a phenomenal rookie year. My God, I thought he was going to win Offensive Rookie of the Year. But they love quarterbacks. Devin White, clean-looking uh, card out of Legacy, right? Yeah. Uh, also, fantastic with the Bucks. Fantastic. Uh, wait, Devin White. Devin Bush is with the, yeah, Steelers. These Devins. Pulled us out of a, um, Donruss, I want to say 2018, uh, thing. Uh, one second. Wow. My camera just nearly fell over. Alright, um, yeah, Emmanuel Sanders. Not game-worn, but, yes, game-used. Thank God. I love that. I don't know why I didn't catch that before. Feels like I'm... It's been a while since I've looked at the stuff. But, yeah, cleanest route runner in the league. One of the cleanest. My God, that's why he's been in the league for so long. Deshaun Hamilton, rookie threads. Oh, man. I don't know what the hell he's going to do. I feel like they drafted so many people much better than him. Like, well, the KJ Hamler is literally better than him. Uh, Jerry Judy, obviously. Like, damn. I don't know what they're going to do um, with Deshaun Hamilton. Not a big fan. Uh, Ted Ginn Jr. now on the Bears, which is funny as hell because, man, this guy has had a long-ass career. Long-ass career. Let me see if that's a uh, game used. Uh, event worn. Okay. All right. What I expected. All right. There is some other stuff. Uh, Darius Slay out of 999. Pretty short print, as you can see. Uh, shiny as hell. Um, now on the Eagles, which is an interesting card to have now. Uh, was that a rookie card? Yeah, that was a rookie card. I pulled it out of a uh, prime pack. Manny Lawson. I want to say it's a number out of 50. No, 65 out of 99. Um, didn't amount to much, if I remember right. This is, I pulled this out of a hot pack as well off of eBay. I don't remember which one. Rookies and Stars. Oh, no, where do you go? NC State. Okay. You got 10 sacks. All right. That's senior year. Ooh, this kid right here. Taylor Rapp. Man, he shined out near the end of the season for the Rams. Made some key tackles. He had an uh, interception. Uh, this one's numbered out of 10. Pretty short print, literally. So, unlike the other one, unlike the Slay. But what a clean-looking card. Phoenix has, my in my opinion, some of the cleanest-looking cards ever. Like, damn. Love that card. Indelible Ink, Tariq Cohen. So, I bought this card for like 10 bucks, And all my other cards have appreciated in value. This is at 10 out of 10. Uh, but this one, I feel like, has not because he had a down year. Um, like, damn. All these cards that I've gotten are either before the season started or mid-season. This card, holy shit, Chris Godwin. What the on-card auto, 43 out of 75, helmet patch and a glove, I think, or just jersey. But, damn, this card I got for like 20 bucks, and now it's going for like close to 100 how insane is that? I don't know. James Conner, okay. Uh, another uh, player that had a down year, which kind of affected all of his cards. Let's see. Yeah, I have a um, contender's auto of him. I don't know what to do with that. I kind of wanted to sell it, but I waited too long. Accolades and uh, 2018 Pro Bowl selection, James Conner. Yeah, he had a fantastic year that year. Player worn material, yep. All right, rookie card of Andy Isabella out of Spectra Radiant. Oof, look at that three-colored patch. Horrible auto. Man, I hate his auto so much. Like, what the fuck is that, Andy? Do you not know how to write? Like, what? You're lucky you're fast as hell. Like, what the fuck? All right, 20 out of 50, but shit makes no sense. I mean, look at that. Dude needs help. Um... Kyle needs to take him to kindergarten or some shit so he can learn how to write again.
All right, back to this. Let's see, Gio Bernard. Clean looking card. I got this at a Prime Pack Elite 2013 Aspirations. Nice short print. Not much else to say. He was a decent running back. He still he still is. I mean, he's a really good handcuff for Joe Mixon. 47 out of 50, Earl Campbell, short print, um, Tops Legends. What a sick looking card. It's got the Houston Oilers stuff on it. Look at that. 70 t 74 touchdowns. What a beast. Earl Campbell. Man. Absolute beast. Pulled that out of a hot bag. Ooh, I got this one for like uh, 11 bucks. I want to say. Um, also in a hot pack or off of eBay. I do not remember. But Paul Krause is an interception leader in NFL history. That shit will not be broken. Um, there's no stats on the back, so I can't remember the name. But what a clean looking card. Immaculate collection. Paul Krause, class of 98. 58 out of 99. Whew. A ball. Uh, he's just a baller. Darren Hall out of Prism. Um, very clean looking card. Um, sucks that his career was absolute ass. But it is what it is. Decent running backs. You know, that's what the running back career is like. You just don't pan out sometimes. And it's probably a higher chance of not panning out. Amar Darbo. Oh my god, I hate this dude. I hate this card. Turn of the century. I have like three. I have like two more of these that I sold on eBay like a long time ago. Let's see. Oh, two. Two out of 49. Turn of the century. God, he's a bum. I don't think he's going to make it on. He's not. He's probably not even on the practice squad. Philly Brown. Corey Brown. Love this card. Sweet looking. Uh, uh, Spectra. Spectra makes some nice looking cards. Let's see. Yeah. 55 out of 99. Not bad, not bad. Probably not worth much, but hey. Chris Sims. Why is this in this pile? I don't know. Let's, alright, interesting. Maybe because I put it in there because, oh, uh, it's like got that chrome finish. Maybe. Uh, Sweet looking card. Not that, not that great of a player. I mean, look at that. Ten touchdowns for seven INTs. Like, ugh. Fuck that. And oh my god, this guy follows every YouTuber, every fucking like pack opener on uh in history. I feel like Gary Jennings Jr. You do not want to see his face anywhere near your hits. My god. I mean, yeah, I guess it's cool that it's a gold auto, gold pen auto, but that doesn't mean shit when the player is not even in the league anymore. Or on the practice squad, if I remember right. Alright, these are some cooler cards. Let me bring these bad boys over. Josh Allen out of 299, 203 at 299. Nice big patch out of certified. Ooh, look at that height though. 6'5, 235. God damn, he a big boy. Joshua Allen. Oh my god, I can't wait to see how he does this year with the uh, uh Sammy not Sammy Watkins. Who am I thinking of? Stefan Diggs instead. Man, I low-key have a really nice Bills collection. Look at that. Freddie Jackson, down and dirty, huge ass, like, on a playbook card, uh, running back, yeah, game worn, it better be game worn, down and dirty, like, look at that, damn, what a clean looking card, uh, 16 out of 32, uh, man, this guy was a beautiful change of pace back when, uh, McCoy, Shady McCoy first moved out, no, with CJ Spiller, CJ Spiller and him, oh my god, what a deadly combo for, like, two years, and then CJ Spiller just kind of sucked. Uh, but yeah, I'm a huge Fred Jackson fan. <sighs> Fred Jackson, whew, what a beast. Roddy White, oh man. Julio's mentor. A uh, guy who was in the league for a long ass time when I started watching football around like 2008. I remember seeing him. He's such a beast, holy cow. Alright, this is pretty short print. 23 out of 25, is there an auto? No. That would have been cool. Let's see. Hopefully this is game. Yeah, this is game worn. I think I'm going to keep most of my game worn stuff and whatever is like high in value right now. I think I'm going to sell. I'm just going to keep like a small game worn co collection. Tyus Bowser. And I'm going to get all my rookies graded. I just wanted to say that too. I have a bunch of Lamar's rated rookies. Um, Mahomes or two. Um, so I'm definitely going to get that graded. Tyus Bowser, he's still on the Ravens. He signed a deal this offseason. He's okay. 
He's okay. I love this card. Ooh, Mark Gastineau. New York Sack Exchange, baby. Look at that. Look at that long-ass mane that he's got over there. My God, what a beast. And I love the patch, too. And this has definitely got to be game-worn. How is this only player-worn? Damn. But look at that uh, auto. He number 99. What a beast. Yeah, if you ever... So... Cause there's no sports going on right now. I've been just watching old games replays from like years ago. Cause Game Pass is uh, currently free. Um, there are some good games that I missed out on. Rookie Phenom, Sterling Shepard. Uh, once again, do you see any Eagles cards? I don't know why I don't. I have like three that I can name. He's got a clean route runner. Oh my! Outside of the concussion issue, I feel like he should be much better this coming year. Hopefully he just tries to stay healthy, you know. It was just tough to like ask of anybody playing a physical sport. TJ Hawkinson. Alright, he started out fantastic. That one game was awesome. It was awesome. You saw how dominant he was, especially under against uh linebackers and shit like that. Uh, which is kind of easy, but like even uh, especially in the end zone, holy cow, he was just taking off and just get, finding himself in the right spot. But if you watched any other game, oh my god, I just felt like outside of the injury that he sustained, he just wasn't, um, he wasn't producing. Like, like damn, I know they had terrible quarterback play, but come on, like you have to, he he needs to prove a lot again uh, this next year, sophomore year. Extra points, 5 out of 25, Antonio Gates, 2013 Prestige. What a clean-looking card. Man, I love this card. It's just nice. It's just nice. It's nice to have a Hall of Famer. I got that out of Prime Pack. Uh, Cody Latimer, Dirty Laundry Rookie Card. This is not game-used. I remember seeing this. I was like, how the fuck is this dirty if it's not game-used? I don't get Panini. I do not. But you just got to... Do what you can. Oh, Deshaun Hamilton. Um, pull this out of somebody's hot packs off of eBay, if I remember right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure at this point the one touch is more valuable than Deshaun Hamilton himself. Um, sad, but probably the truth. 49 out of 75. Yeah, as I said before, I don't think he's gonna have a place on this team in like a year or two, maybe less. Whew. Brian Westbrook. I didn't even bother taking this up. I got this for like 30 bucks off of eBay. Um, that's game worn. I'm not even going to check the back because I know it's game worn. Love me some Brian Westbrook. What a nice on-card auto too. Damn. Look at that. Capstones. Game used uh, material. At 3 out of 35. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Love it. Man, I, I, honestly, I kind of want to try to pull a 1 of 1. How sick would that be? Because I don't have any. But, like, that's asking for a lot. All right, Deontay Greenberry, he's a bum. Um, he hasn't, he didn't do much in the NFL career. Alan Page, on the other hand, is a goddamn beast. Oh, my God. Love this card. Love this card. It's kind of scribbled around, but, man, he had a hell of a career. 42 out of 99. Same set, Immaculate Collection. Maybe I might just, like, try to find the other Hall of Famers because I love them. Uh, he was a dominant player. He would just push people out of the way, get to the quarterback. He was a sackly. He was the only other MVP uh, other than LT, defensive MVP. Jadavion Clowney, this fucking clown. Oh, my God. I hate him because what he did to Carson. 103 out of 145. 149. Yeah, I got this card for like four bucks. So I was just like, how the hell with it? Why not? Enclosed event. Warm material. Yeah. If I remember right. Um on card auto which is nice doesn't even look like a clown or actually does c l o kind of d not bad but man i don't think he's worth the money oh yes this beautiful card this card is worth actually a lot right now because it came out of gold standard i got it for like 25 bucks it's probably around 50 or so 27 out of 75 nick bosa rookie patch auto dual patch Obviously, player worn. Um, this was his rookie year. Oh, this is a funny card. Kristen Michael, uh, rookie card out of 399, 369. New breed, elite Donruss. Um, man, I love this guy. He was a freak, a freak. Dude could run like a beast. 
but had no vision. That was one of his biggest problems. I, he, like, you would have the block set up in front of him. I swear, he just, like, tried to out-muscle, um, like, the players in front of him to get yards instead of just following his damn blocks. Steven Jackson. Oh, my God. I'm probably not going to ever sell this card. Flawless uh, Rams. Two... Look at that clean ass autograph on card blue, distinguished patch autos. Yeah, out of fifteen, man, uh, this was like seventeen bucks or something like that. Game used material. That's what I like. Nice. CMC patch, clean looking card, sparkly, feats of strength. Um, player worn material. Maybe feels as. Maybe if I pull this like or later, maybe it might have been game worn because you know higher chance of the individual having been in the game. Uh, NFL rookie collection. Let's see, Brian Quick. Nah, eh, kind of fizzled out after like three, four years, which isn't bad at all. Yeah, let's see at the NFL PA rookie premiere. All right, event worn material. Not bad. He was he was a fast receiver though. Uh, the Rams had like a trio of shitty receivers that year. His rookie year, I remember. Uh, him, I, I don't want to say Isaiah Pede. Uh, let me think. Damn. Ah, there he is, Chris Gibbons, one of them. Yeah, Chris Gibbons and Donnie Avery, another one in the back. Hold up. Actually, I actually have quite a few of shitty Rams uh, stuff, which is funny. All right, Farrell Cooper, uh, signature marks out of 50. Nice looking card. Ironically, he actually has a All Pro, which is pretty sick. Farrell Cooper has a All Pro for, as a kick returner. Um, and then he started develop. He started getting the yips, so he kind of fucked himself over. Chris Givens, um, almost as similar to what's his face, Brian Quick as it gets. Fast dude. Let's see. Uh, this was at a two forty. Um, Material worn by all right, rookie premier card. Okay, nothing special. Donnie Avery, sweet looking card. I love upper deck. Man, I wish I got more upper deck stuff. Uh, event used memorabilia. All right, cool, cool. All right, I'm gonna get through these fast. Zachariah Ertz. All right, three seven seven three ninety nine. Love this card. Only Eagles. <laughs> the other Eagles card I got. Jaleel Scott. Oh man. I have, like, what, the other one's also Julio Scott, right? Yeah, player-worn material, nothing special, rookie card. Maybe because it's the Ravens it'll go for something, who knows. Noah Fant, baby, this freak, this athletic freak. Uh, player-worn material, not bad. Optic always has the cleanest shit ever. Rookie gear, Drew Locke, love this card. Definitely a good hit uh, to have pulled. Especially considering how uh, awesome I think his future is going to be. Josh Doxson. He's currently on the Vikings, I think. Maybe practice squad. Something like that. He's a bit of a bum. You know his story. All right, hold up. There might be some random cards in here. Just going to quickly. Trubisky. Mac. All right, I don't know what these cards are doing in there, but not part of the thing. Actually, you know what? The Bolden's pretty cool. Huge Anquan Bolden fan. He is a beast. Uh, there's stuff here. Hold up. Marquise Brown. A uh, few rookies. Ooh, AJ Brown. Gardner Minshew. Ooh, Jared Stidham found this card. I, I couldn't find it. After I lost it a while back in a mess. But there it is. Jared Stidham, the new Patriots quarterback, who I think is going to fizzle out. He's going to burn. He's going to... Not do as hot as people think he is. Hollywood Brown out of, uh, hold up, what does that say? 68? Yeah, 66 out of 68. Pretty cool. Marquise Brown again, rated rookie. Pink Hollow um, out of Optic. Clean looking card. I'm actually sending this to a subscriber. Um, Car Curtis Samuel, I can't believe I found it. Oh yeah, Cam, Cam Newton on the back. Um, the rookie threads card. I completely forgot to send it to him, but I will send it to him soon. Probably to tomorrow or today, cause uh, I have to ship some some stuff out. 
Devin Singletary, first impressions, 299, clean looking card. Ooh, rookie out of illusions. He is a fast motherfucker. Goddamn. His jukes are so clean. I I can't wait to see what he does with the rest of his career, especially these coming years. Now that he doesn't have Frank Gore um, next to him. Mike Evans uh, out of 67. Yeah, 87. Mike Evans rookie card. Not bad. Debo Samuel. Oh, man. The, if they won the Super Bowl, this guy would have been worth a lot more. But they didn't because they're bums. 29 out of 130. Not bad. War Room Materials. Yeah, player worn. Uh, Derwin James. I don't know why it's out here. And Bryce Petty. This is technically a hit, so nah, I'll show it. This is Game Worn. No, Player Worn Salute to Service. I do love the Salute to Service cards, though. I can't really find any on eBay right now, but I would definitely get them if I could find them. All right, let me quickly go through this. Kenyon Drake Jumbo Patch. Uh, rookie Auto. Uh, gold, Panini Gold, Black and Gold, yeah, Bama Kids, baby, my god, what a beast, um, he's, he killed it this past year, uh, when, he, when, it was, when it was his time to, you know, jump up and start running with the ball, he did it, James Conner, the infamous James Conner, uh, contenders draft picks, clean looking auto, clean looking auto, I wish it was normal contenders, cause I'm pretty sure that's worth more, but, eh, you get what you get. This is a Jim Brown I was talking about. Kind of sad story about this. The guy who sold to me, Brian Plant, uh, maybe shouldn't have said that, but it was listed on eBay for like 14 bucks. You know, you win some, you lose some, 6 out of 10, yeah. And then I bought it for like 34 so definitely not the winner on that one. Could have just gone on eBay and looked at that but because it was out of a hot pack. Uh, Seminoles, Demarcus Christmas, great name. Great name. Uh, nice auto. Nothing much else to say about that. Taylor Rapp pulled this bad boy out of a retail pack, which is pretty sick. Huskies. Uh, love this dude. Can't wait to see what he does. Uh, let's see. Connor Vernon. I want to say tight end. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the Duke. Cool. 170, 17 out of 199. Not bad. Let me just rearrange this. Alright, Ryan Kerrigan, one of my most favorite players in the league, uh, 87 99. man, he's always, he, his motor is like evidently, you can see that shit running when you watch him play against any team, he's always pushing, he's always like uh, the first one to get to the quarterback, and he just moves fast, and you can tell, you can tell how uh, big of an impact he can have on a game. I remember when he destroyed uh, Big V years ago, Trent Murphy, back when he was on the Redskins. I think he's on the Lions now. Yeah. Anthony Nix, Mix, uh, wide receiver. This is out of Topps, DDQ packs, and pulled that one out of those packs. Um, Marlon Mack, baby. Prestige, uh, not bad, just a patch. Tom Brady, Topps, Chrome. Why do I have this in here? Oh, yeah, because it's worth something, I think, like 20 bucks or something like that. I'll double check, but I should get this graded. Um, end zone, DRC, end zone icons. I thought that was like part of the patch or something, but it's just a... Oh, it is part of the end zone. Oh, that's dope. Manufactured team end zone. Awesome. DRC, baby. This is a freak. Um, Don Threads, Joey Bosa. One of the cleanest pass rushers in the league. Man. He has some finesse with him. His hands are just constantly moving. Like, the lineman just can't even catch catch him. His hands are just constantly moving up and down, forward, backward, stabbing, all that kind of shit. Um, let's see, Joy Bell. Oh, my God. Uh, Titans versus Lions 2013. You have to watch that game if you got this far in this video. That game is insane. Uh, 15 out of 130. He killed it in that game, but, man, wow, what a game. Oh, Mr. DUI, Seattle Seahawks, Alex Collins. Oh, the, sad. Sad. He could have had a good career, but no. He had to lose his job by drinking. All right, Frank Gore out of Tops DPP again. I think I pulled that one too. And let's see, AJ Hawk. Yeah, AJ Hawk, rookie. 
Uh, Jersey, nice looking card. Alfred Morris, oh, I love this card. I don't want to open it too many times because I don't want the binding to like break or something. Alfred Morris, ooh, look at that. Awesome auto. Uh, yeah, touch it. had to touch it. Game warm material, obviously, but damn. Panini Playbook can really make some nice cards. They are way too expensive to buy, like, uh, buy a pack up, though. It's insane how much they go for. All right, let me see this. I got this for, like, 12 bucks off of a hot pack. Um, select 20, I can't see, 15, 15, yeah. Jeremy Hill, uh, now not in the league, if I'm right. Yeah, rookie auto. Sweet looking card. Three out of five, ultra short print, which is pretty awesome. Definitely, maybe I'll try to trade that to someone who likes... Uh, Bengals, D. Milner, oh my god, what a bust, what a bust, one of the many busts in that class, uh, let's see, um, Mark, uh, Brandon Cooks, I nearly said Marquez Colston, 31 out of 199, uh, Ernie Sims, 92 out of 999, 99, geez, uh, longevity, rookies and stars, Stephon Taylor in that sweet acetate card, my first hit ever, but sweet looking rookie card. Breezes out of 199.05. Uh, Demontre Moore out of 199. Uh, sweet looking numbered card. Matt Flynn. Um, the bum that was on the New York jo uh, Giants. No, New York Guardians. Yeah, for the XFL. 35 out of 9.99. Matt, why do I keep saying 9.99? I don't know. 35 out of 49. Pretty short print. Yeah, so. Let's see. You know, Lauren Itis, Gridiron Kings, Eli Manning, 72 out of 100, cool. Um, Josh Harvey Clemens, a linebacker, I don't think he did much in the league. Uh, Xavier Gooden, also, uh, he might have gone to the Rams. I No, not the Rams, the Ravens, um, don't remember much after that. Bethel Johnson, sweet looking card. It looks like he had a funeral in this card, though. I mean, like, why the fuck would you, like, it just looks like he's disappearing. Clean, clean looking card though, like it's definitely well made. 41 out of 99, just looks sad. Alright, let's see. Uh, Kevin Johnson out of Wake Forest. Cool. Draft picks, draft picks, yeah. I pulled a lot of draft picks. Uh, Julio, red, white, blue. What a clean looking card that is too. Gotta stop saying clean, but I can't say anything else. I don't know if it's. Uh, I wish it was a rookie, but it's not. EJ Manuel. I don't know why I have this in here, but out of Bowman, um, oh yeah, oh no, 092 out of 499, and then Damian Williams, um, let's see, 8 out of 50, nice looking card, but yeah, that's pretty much the collection, oh wait, forgot this big one right here, Calvin Ridley, and that pretty much does it.